how to add a calculator to Wix website. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how easy it is to add a calculator to your Wix website. All you need to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you will be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to head over to Wix.com. Then you only need to select one of the websites that you own. Then you're going simply right there to click on select and edit. If you don't have a website yet, you're going to see here the create a new website here um, window. Then you are have the choice to choose between Wix Studio or the standard Wix editor. Make sure that you're going to use one of these two. Then you're going to proceed to the theme or the help of the AI. Now I'm going to select the website I have. Then it will lead me directly to the dashboard of that specific website. Right here, we're going to click on edit site. And after that, you're going to be redirected directly here to the website itself. In my case, I have already uh, preloaded the uh, website. So it will take a little bit of time from you. Then you are going to see here the different component of your website. Now, let's say that we have uh, did, uh, we did everything uh, from the steps before, from signing in and visiting the website. We are going to add uh, the uh, calculator. How we can do that? Simple. You are going to head over Google google.com then you are going simply to type in calculator or html code for calculator it doesn't matter for any of the calculators you can see tons of models uh, on the uh, net but you're going to choose one of them and get the html code and this is how is the html code is going to look like so you're going to copy the code then you are going to head over here after that, you are going simply to select the, um, or going ahead to click on add element before selecting the section. Then we are going to click on embed code. After that, you are going simply to click on embed HTML. And here we have the HTML settings. Make sure that you are not going to choose the website address, but the code. Now, once here, you are going to type in here the code. Click on update when you finish, then you are going to exit that. Boom, here we have our calculator ready. So we are going to let it right there. Images are going or getting in the way. So here we have the calculator. Let's make it a little bit smaller, but smaller to make sure that everything is going to be well addressed. So here we have the calculator. Everything is good and set up correctly. So. As you can see, this is an example of calculator using HTML. Boom. You can go ahead and use this calculator by clicking on preview and make sure that it will work correctly. Don't forget to click on save and boom. That was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one.